Well, hello there, friends, and welcome to my video. I am Mickey B. Have we met? If not, it's nice to meet you. And if we have, you know it's always good to see you again. Today, I have a Dollar Tree haul that I would like to share with you. So without further ado, let's jump right into it, shall we? I don't want to be here all day, and I know you don't. So let's just jump into this bag and get this party started. First item I'm going to share with you is this raw shea butter soap. Now, this was something new. I've never seen it before. It has a nice smell. I use shea butter, you know, for my natural viewers. You know, I'm a natural and I use shea butter on my hair. Actually, I've been using it on my hands as well. I use it to, um, after I wash my hands, instead of lotion, I use shea butter. I feel like it lasts longer. I've never had a shea butter soap. This is how big it is. So if it's pretty much the majority of uh, shea butter, it says it gently moisturizes skin. So if it's pretty much shea butter, I can't imagine this is not going to be good. But of course, I'm definitely going to test it out because I am a shea butter user. Next item I have here is, we've got some Kiss Nails that just came through. And these are kind of like a, what kind of print is that? Leopard animal, I'll just say animal print. I guess that's the safest way to say it when you're not sure which animal it might be. Um, but you get 24 nails. I'm trying to get that glare off so you guys can really get a good look at them. So hopefully, I can't remember which way to hold it to make that happen. So bear with me. Hopefully you can get a good look at the pattern. And it's a brown one. Is that brown? Yeah, it's a brown one and an animal print one. And it doesn't come with glue or anything. It just says Kiss Fantasy Nails. Now I have others here that I wanna pull out and share with you. I also have this um, Daisy Orange and Daisy set here. This one comes with the glue already on it. It's Press On Nails. And this one does not. This one is really cute and summery. And this one says, let me get my glasses on because I don't know why I think I can get away without putting them on but these say 24 nails as well amazing gel look ultra smooth finish is what this one says and this one says now with super hold adhesive so i'm trying to give you guys a real close-up of what it's saying but this lighting is not working with me no glue needed peel off and press on so you can't get any simpler than that Okay, so we've got those items. I don't have a lot here. This is gonna be really quick. Then I found these boogie balloons, as they call them. There's a two pack, they're for ages five plus. You feel, seal, throw, and repeat. Let's just open it up real quick and see ooh, what that looks like. Oh, darn it, they're just kinda sealed very well. Uh, hold on one second. Okay, I got the box open what it looks like and it just has two in the box with a little sheet of instructions on how to use them i'm guessing one might be english one might be spanish or it just gave me two so it came, came with two instructions fill the product with water place the product in water fill it with water Close the product, ensure there are no gaps. The ball must be sealed to avoid leakage. So it seems pretty simple. This is what they look like. Like that, they're silicone. Stick them in water, and then you seal it up like that once you have water in them. Silicone's probably gonna allow it to have a tight close. Can't really tell here. And then you throw it, it pops open, and you reuse it again. I don't know how practical these are going to be, I mean, when you do a water balloon fight, you don't run and get the water balloon and reuse it. You just get another one. So since there's only two in a box, I can't imagine that's going to be a pretty exciting uh, water balloon fight. You got to keep chasing your water balloon to refill it. But it's a cute idea and, you know, it's um, earth friendly, I guess. So, you know, we'll play with them, throw one at Janae when she's least expecting it. Maybe that is the safest route. Then they can't get you back with one because it's, unless they gotta go fill it up. 
and they can't just immediately retaliate. All right, oh, this next item, this is something, this is a different style of these fountains that I hauled before. Um, this one, it's similar, but different. It has the same incense that the other ones had that comes in here. And this design for this one looks like this. Let's open it up for you. It's a little different. Oh, this is actually quite pretty though. This is what this one looks like. It looks like a leaf. It's dripping down into a leaf. So this is nice. And these are great. Janae's dog, honey. I'm telling you, I'm not making this up. Honey has a farting problem and she stinks up the whole back end of the house. And the only thing strong enough <laughs> to really counter it is some incense, because these incense are pretty strong. In fact, they're so strong, I have to open, make sure the windows are open when I use them. But honey, I don't know what she's eating. She's allergic to something, but she'd be just be blowing up the house and I just can't take it no more. So I got uh, another one of these so that we can hopefully counter the problem. And the next, ooh, the next two items. Gee, I feel so discombobulated today. Um, we've got uh, two nature, Guru, Na Ugh, Guru Nanda toothbrushes. Now I hauled another set of toothbrushes that they had before, as well as the toothbrush caps, but they didn't have these at the time. And I'm not sure if I found these at the same store that I found those other ones at, but this is what they look like. Um, they say soft bristle. And this is what they look like. I know, what do they promote? It says big tuft bristles, um, smile clean. Uh, what does it say? More bristles, better clean. One toothbrush. Am I even in the frame? More bristles, better clean. One toothbrush. What I like about this, look at the handle. Look at how big it is. It looks like it'll be really comfortable to hold in your hand, like ergonomically correct. They had this color as well as that color. So that's the difference with these two, but they are actually the same toothbrush. Now on the back of this, it says, is there anything important here? Um, help clean the tooth surface more effectively, rubberized ergonomic handle for ease and comfort. So that I can see. Smooth ended bristles help clean, help deep clean and protect teeth and gums. Angle necked designed to reach hard to reach areas with ease. Pretty much what all toothbrushes kind of claim, but they're soft bristles. Um, I'll give them a try at some point but i do like the handle and i really feel like the handle is going to be comfortable so i wanted to try those okay the next item i have this is something that i passed over is two of these i've seen them before they are the edge wax let's see do i have it right side up for you the edge wax and they had coconut watermelon and shea butter scented I thought it interesting that they actually had scents um, instead of just edge wax, you know, with just like a normal scent to it, but not like a flavored scent like coconut. And shea butter, I guess, is normal. But the other scent they had was watermelon, and I smelled it, and I'm like, I don't think I would want to even try a watermelon scented edge wax. Edge wax doesn't really work for me, but these were only $1.25. I'm trying to open it for you so you can see what it looks like. It's called wax, but to me, it looked more like um, a gel and it feels jelly. I can't get this thing open. Let's see if we can do it this way. Okay, there we go. All right, so this is what it looks like on the inside. You see how jelly it looks? doesn't look waxy, but it looks jelly. And it does have a shea butter smell to it, but kind of like a little perfume in the background because true shea butter smells very earthy and nutty. Not a, doesn't really have a perfume smell. So let's see. See, it even, what does it feel like? That's what it looks like on my hand. But it kind of, it feels like a Vaseline gel. 
And I know that's weird to kind of think of, but you see it's shiny on my finger. I don't know, it's interesting. I'll have to play with this and see if it does anything. It's not a bad smell though. It definitely smells like a hair product. Um, and then there's this coconut one. Now, I don't know how well this is gonna work, but here's the coconut version. And what do they say on this bottle? It says, a uh, long lasting hold flake free formula. This is by the brand B Color. I guess that's part of B Pure. And it says apply a generous amount of, oh, a generous amount on desired area. Using your index finger, smooth product with your preferred edge tool. That's all it says. So, and it's so tiny, <laughs> I was struggling to read that. But this one says the same thing. So I will give it a try and play with it and see if it does anything for my edges. It'll probably do better maybe with Jenea, um, but I'll, we'll, maybe we'll both play in it and see how we like it. But. I've seen it a couple times and I was like, let me just give this a try. So last time, I don't know if I held it up long enough for you guys to really get a look at it. So let me give you a close up. Coconut edge control gel and shea butter edge control gel. Okay. Now the next item I have is, this is something I thought would be good to have for the summer if summer ever gets here are these Essentials After Sun Face and Body Towelettes. You get 30 of them in a package and they are Arm & Hammer brand. And I like, what I liked about them, it says it's with natural baking soda and aloe vera. And you know, after the sun, if you get sunburn or if you just get too hot, aloe vera is very cooling and baking soda is very natural. So it doesn't feel like you'd be putting a lot of perfumey type stuff on your skin, especially after having been in the sun. So they had uh, just a few of these. Um, this is the first time I'd seen them. I don't know if they're new, they're new to me. And if in case they're new to you and it's something you're interested in, then keep a lookout for them. But it seems like it's a good product to have, you know, come for the upcoming summer season. And then the last thing that I have here, is there anything else in there? Nope, nope, nope. Last thing I have is this. I found another um, Pride shower gel. Is that what it's called? Scented bath and shower gel. This one's called Purple Frenzy. Scented bath and shower gel. I have not opened it. I guess I can open it now and see what Purple Frenzy smells like. And it's sealed. Make sure which, if you get on that, they are sealed. Let's give it a smell. I smell absolutely nothing. Is it open? Oh, it's because I didn't open it. There's a plastic underneath the foil. <laughs> so I'm like, okay. Hmm. It smells, let me give it another smell because I didn't, ooh, oh, wow. Uh, don't you hate when people do this on camera? <laughs> you can't tell what they're smelling. They can't tell what they're smelling. And I'm supposed to tell you, make you understand what I'm smelling. It just smells like a regular generic shower gel. I don't smell any special herb scents or anything in there. It doesn't smell bubbly like fruity or anything like that. It's just, it really just smells like a generic scented gel. I can't, nothing comes to mind when I smell it. It doesn't even smell familiar other than that. All right, you guys, 
This was probably <laughs> the worst Dollar Tree haul I've ever done. I don't know why. I just felt like discombobulated. So, but that's all I have right now. It's just, it wasn't a lot going on at my Dollar Tree this past weekend. So, um, I was struggling just to find this. So, if you saw something that you like, I think the only thing that really I was excited about in this haul was this. And I'm looking forward to trying this because I am a shea butter person. Um, and these, I'm just glad to have these in my arsenal because it is going to get hot. And I think if nothing else, these are going to just be great cooling off um, towelettes as well. Because you know how if you're out in the sun and it's hot and you just sweat, it'll just be nice to have something to cool you off. And the fact that, it, again, it has that aloe vera is a plus. So that's it, you guys. Thanks so much for watching my haul. And I will see you in the next one. And in the meantime, you guys take care and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Now, where is my, here we go. Here we go. So let me just do it again. So, so take care, you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.